Welcome to the Countless Vlogcast. How are you today? State your name, please. Hey, guys. Uh, uh, I'm Lilia Get. Uh, I came from Croatia and almost three years I live in Belgium now. I'm a photographer and digital artist. So when, when did you start taking photographs and doing digital art? Uh, almost three years. When I moved to Belgium, I started with my phone. Uh, I think it was a, about five years, six. But uh, my boyfriend uh, saw my photos. Uh, he see what I can do only with a mobile phone that was not so good quality. So, <laughs> so he thought that uh, I'm talented and he buy me camera, Nico, and uh, laptop so I can make my uh, photos and yeah, and uh, I was always curious, so mm -hmm. I didn't stop only with photos, I wanted something more, mm -hmm. so I uh, tried to work with him, with a program for edits, and I think uh, I made it quite well. Mm. <laughs> now. So um, when you first started doing your art, what inspired you to start with the art and photographs and paintings and whatnot? Mm, I started with my cats. Mm. I have two mm. cats, Maine mm. Coon and Mix. And after that, uh, I was uh, going to one big zoo in Belgium. It's really nice. Mm. Uh, it's Pairi Daiza. It's a really big uh, zoo. Uh, I was, uh, I came in, in a, at nine I am, and I came out at nine p.m. So mm. <laughs> it was funny because I didn't know how big it was. Mm. Uh, I didn't bring any food with me, and I saw people with the uh, big baskets and everything. I said, "What's wrong with these people?" <laughs> 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 and later I find out why. <laughs> oh yeah, so it was a big park for like picnics and all that too, so it's yeah. good. Right? Yeah, because the people who go there spend there all day. So um, when you first started doing your art, what were some of your first um, photographs? Like what was your first, like, first two photographs you took? Uh, my friend. Mm. Yeah. Uh, okay. I took photo of her. And I edited like mixing uh, her face with my cat. And I sent it to Fujifilm. And I won a prize there for yeah. photo. <laughs> they like it. And uh, the other photo that I won is uh, it was uh, one competition in one new hotel. Okay. They were asking for artists to send their works so they can uh, put their photos in a uh, room. From that's, that's amazing, though, really. Yeah. So yeah, it's, like a, yeah, it's like being yeah. in a mini museum, kind of, you know? So. Yeah, yeah, and I was guest there at opening. Oh, wow, that's great. <laughs> so really you, must, nice. you, must, you must have felt honored to be, like, a guest, though, like, really, like, you. Just, yeah, like, as an yeah, artist, yeah. you know, you want to feel appreciated, so it must have been really big for you. Yeah, it was. Wow. I'm really proud mm. of myself uh, how much I done in so much so so short time. So, mm. so um, I know you said you did the hotel and all that too, and a couple other things. Um, so who is your audience? Like, what um, who are you trying to like sell your art to, or like uh, who are you trying to reach in terms of your art? Like, uh, that's a tough question because mm. uh, my art with pets. I'm coming uh, for people who love animals mm. so, and have pets. So course. do you get a lot of um, people that want to take pictures of their pets and have like backgrounds of their pets? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But uh, there, there are people that contact me to take photos of their pets too. Mm -hmm. So okay. because they like my photographs, so wow. that's amazing. So you know, you're really growing. So you're gonna be a big artist one day too. Come to the states, and then you gotta be a big artist here too. So. Yeah, great, I wish you luck. Okay. <laughs> but, so, uh, um, yeah, what are you saying? Practice, uh, mm. Every day, 
to make it. Mm. So how do you feel you've grown as an artist and gotten better? How do you feel you've like grown? Uh, because I'm uh, learning much about my mm. camera, about imp, about everything that I take photo. I uh, people say to me that I have a good eye, and mm. I think that uh, that pe uh, people who who are artists especially photograph, mm -hmm. they must have good eye for a photo. Okay. So that, that, <laughs> that they can uh, capture that moment that is mm. important on photo. That's, that's great. Um, yeah. So um, how has this um, pandemic affected you, like the COVID and all that too, and like quarantine? How has that affected your creativity and your art? Have you done like more art or have you done like yeah. the same amount? Mm. Yeah, I <laughs> I have to get to it <laughs> That's my escape. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, in a COVID, I start with art photos. Mm. With so, so uh, what kind of stuff have you been doing? What? What kind of stuff have you been have you been doing in terms of like art during this time? Uh, pet portraits. Pet portraits. Me. Okay. So, have you been going outside? Have you been able to go outside? Or you do it like digitally? Uh, no, I went only to the store, to the mm. market, and mm. that's all. Because here, uh, everything just started to open. Okay. It's not still working, so mm -hmm. you don't have much choice. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, what are some of your pres present goals for now? Like, in the time now, like, you have all this time to, like, working out. What are some of your goals to, like, in the future? Like, pay, like, a month from now, what are some of your goals? Uh, next year I have an expo here in mm -hmm. Belgium, uh, and uh, I will uh, I will make a postcard, mm -hmm. and the postcard will be with the pet art. Mm -hmm. I ask uh, every uh, person that uh, that I made pet portrait. Mm -hmm. I ask can I use it? <laughs> okay. Yeah, and they all say yeah, yeah. That's great. <laughs> that's great. That's but, great. Uh, money. Mm -hmm. From postcards will go to charities for sick children and mm -hmm. animals. Okay. Yeah, and uh, at the opening, uh, yeah. I have a friend who is a singer, and she will sing at the opening. So, um, people that don't know you, watch somebody support your art. Watch somebody buy your art. It's not like uh, that. May may find this interview and watch somebody support your art. Oh. I don't know because it's a hard to uh, if you know uh, if people like you they like you yeah of course if they don't like you you can do anything yeah of course you can't control that so yeah yeah so if people like it uh, I'm glad I think every mm -hmm. person that says your art is great mm -hmm. you have done great it's amazing or I write everyone answer mm -hmm. I'm like that. <laughs> Mm. So, so how do you how do you use your um, social media like Instagram and Facebook? How do you use that to promote yourself and show your art? I put all my art uh, and uh, uh, I ask people to follow me. There is a mm. lot of art groups on mm. Facebook where you can post your art and uh, you can talk with other artists and. Uh, uh, you can follow each other and uh, talk about your art and things like that. And it's, it's for me amazing because uh, it means a lot to one artist when other artists said, oh, your work is amazing, congrats, and things like that. Mm -hmm. uh, that's great, that's great. So um, anything else you want to discuss about your art or anything you want to like um, tell the pe people about your art? I know you're working on postcards and you got an um, expo coming up next year, but anything you want people to know about else about you, about your art? So I know you do photography and like you do um, digital art. What else, anything else you want to talk about in terms of art? Uh, I want to say to people if they uh, wanted to see my art, mm -hmm. that they can visit my uh, Instagram page, uh, Monkey Livia Photography. Mm -hmm. And uh, they can leave even comment, or I would gladly answer. Mm -hmm. And uh, everyone 
I, I will post uh, the date of my expo and okay. everyone is invited. You too, if you okay. can. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I'll be there. <laughs> yeah, it will be a medium, lots of mediums. So. Okay, great. Yeah. So um, it's L I V I J A photography, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, perfect. So guys, go out, follow her, and then she's a great artist. She does, if you love pets, if you love digital art, if you love art in general, support, support, support. Thank you for coming and, on. I appreciate you. Yeah, and uh, I want to thank you for this, Justin. <laughs> After 20 times it took, but you know, we made it through, so. You know. <laughs> yeah, but we made it. <laughs> and, All right. Uh, uh, one more thing, mm -hmm. uh, I want to thank uh, all my friends, my boyfriend, my family, you, <laughs> everyone that is uh, standing uh, behind me and push me to mm. go further. Yeah, that's great. That's how we grow as an artist and people. We grow as artists and help everybody out, you know? So. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. yeah. Thank you well, all very thank much. Thank you very much, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for joining. Um, this has been Kellis Vlogcast episode seven, and we're out. Thank you very much. So. Bye. Bye, everybody.